Hi, this is Wayne Johnson with Pentaho, and today I'd like to show you some Olympic analytics going from a flat file to analytics in Olympic speed. A Pentaho Espresso Shot, part of the Pentaho Espresso Shot series. Today I'm going to show you how I was tracking the Olympics using a simple CSV file to tally the total by all medals, gold, silver, and bronze for each of the countries. Feed that CSV file directly into Pentaho and then build some analytics, some Olympic analytics. Let's go ahead and take a look at what that looks like. So here you'll see I just kept a simple tally of all the countries and as they won medals I would add to their tally. And then what I did was I went ahead and pumped that directly into Pentaho. Let's take a look at how we did that. I just simply select create new data source and here we're going to call it um, Olympics and then here we'll select it as a CSV file and we'll browse to our CSV file and here I have that CSV file as 2012 Olympics click open import and you'll notice it imports my CSV file I have some options here to specify the format of my CSV file but it automatically detects detects it for me so I can click next and here I see the different fields and columns and select finish and it automatically builds the metadata layer for me in order to do my analytics now I went ahead and built it already so let's take a look at what that looks like when I click on new analysis I see here I have the 2012 Olympics that we just built I'm gonna go ahead and click OK and so here I have country and then here I can look at total medals and then I, if I wanted to see this in a geo map I simply select geo map and I can see the medals across the different countries um, I prefer to see this in a Google Street so I could switch the base layer on demand I could zoom in as well now earlier earlier today we we posted uh, our dash our dashboard and it showed uh, we listed the top 10 countries and we had a Pentaho follower mention how Hungary um, <clears throat> had more gold than Australia but Australia showed up on the top 10 so I want to show you uh, how we can compare this I'm first gonna filter on country here and let's go ahead and take a look at Australia and then let's also take a look at Hungary and and then um, let's go ahead and click OK and notice we we see here it's uh, Hungary is in the red and Australia is in the green now this is just by total watch what happens if we want to size it by gold right away we see that Hungary has a, a whole lot more gold medals than Australia by the which is being represented by the size of the the bubble um, additionally let's go ahead and take a look at the dashboard I built so I'm just gonna open and go to Olympics and select 2012 and we're gonna go to the current standing dashboards again here what we're looking at is the top 10 countries in total medals again all this is being built directly off the CSV file I can zoom into it by double clicking on my on this area and maybe I want to select a particular country so let's say United States and we want to select China and we may want to select the United States or we can highlight particular countries as well and and only look at those countries if we'd like so for example we want to keep only the selected items or we could go back to our dashboard by simply double clicking on the total there here we notice that if I if I highlight here Japan, while Japan has earned 38 medals, we we can hover over this dot here in Korea. Even though they've earned less medals total, they've earned more gold medals. And then to the right here we see the geo mapping as well. This has been a quick example of of following something I I really enjoyed to watch the Olympics and being able to take that data and put it directly into Pentaho off a simple CSV file to do some Olympic size analytics.